Weekend is upon us now. Are you ready for it? It looks like it's going to be a fairly nice weekend, and we might get some rain out of the deal as well. So that's always welcome in July. Tonight, clear skies. Live look for the Bob Mills Furniture Sky Live weather camera in Temple. Rain anticipated out in West Texas is a stalled out low pressure system there. It's a thermal low. It's there all all season long, really. But a dry line has developed along that and it's going to give them a chance of some rain out in West Texas. We also showers in the forecast from Oklahoma City to Tulsa on back over towards Texarkana. More area of rain from about Lufkin down towards Houston and on down the Gulf Coast towards Bay City into Matagorda Bay. From there south, it dries out. It looks like it's going to be beautiful for South Padre Island if your weekend takes you to the uh, the seashore this weekend. Looks like it's going to be nice with rain-free conditions. 100 degree days average. By this time, we're looking at close to 10, 11, sometimes 12 100 degree days. We've had one. One 100 degree day in June, so we are we're very mild season for us so far, temperature wise. Average first 100 degree day is July the 4th. Ours occurred on June the 13th. 96 degrees high today in Mahia. Our thanks to April Paralini at the Confederate Union Grounds. 98 in Coppers Cove. Michael Parsons, our weather watcher there. And up in Bosque County, Nancy Marin's reporting a high of 103 degrees in Clifton, 103 degrees in Belton as well. Our thanks go out to Ron Tittle. Fair skies for us here. The Doppler net is showing a little bit of shower activity over in deep east Texas from Nacogdoches on back down towards Lake Toledo Bend. We got shower activity out in the Davis Mountains and the Guadalupe Mountains of far west Texas, but otherwise it's quiet right now. As that tropical wave moves on in, we'll see our rain chances beginning to increase from probably the Waco Temple Clean Area on south. We'll start looking at 40% chances of showers and carry that through Saturday night into Sunday and likely into Monday as well. Not everybody's going to get this. When I say 40% chances of rain, I'm talking that's probably the high end of it because San Saba, you're probably not going to see much more than a 20% chance of rain. On the other end of the scope, Cameron, Centerville, you're looking at probably 50% chances of showers and some heavy rain at times. Uh, the further east you go, the more moisture rich the atmosphere is. All right, Andy, thank you very much, okay. sir.